with your very own pet boy. Since this was such a special occasion, do you know what I did? I wrote you a poem. Oh. Just for you. I hope you like it. Can you read it to me naked? Yeah. Of course. Run along now, dearie, and have yourself a wonderful birthday. Yeah. I fucking hate you. Well, let's read this bitch's poem. Or not. Where's my... You didn't even give me the poem. What's wrong with you? Ah, uh, he's gonna rip it. He's gonna stick his big... Well, probably small, you know. You know. You know how it is. I take it, it's that... Yeah. Hi there. What are you doing down here, young man? I thought kids weren't allowed down on the reactor. I thought kids weren't allowed. I'm not a kid. I'm ten years old. <laughs> you sure are. Pet boy and everything. Look at that. If you can wait just one more minute, I think your dad will want to give you the surprise himself. Uh, I don't want to lose my virginity to my own father. Ugh. Yeah, I can't not pick. Yep, gang rape. Are you ready for your surprise? Oh, God. What kind of surprise? You see, I gave you your pick boy. You're old enough to do some more. So, I figure you're old enough for... Oh, God. Your own BB gun. Oh, thank God. Jonas found it down here. It was in pretty rough shape. It was a good three months to find the parts to get it working. Wow, for a second there, I thought it was going to cover my bum. Good thing Woods must place that switch blade of this. <laughs> so, what do you think? Want to give it a try? We sure can't. Once we want the overseer, we can go with the I don't like Liam Mason patronizing me. I mean, he's awesome and all, but he was in the Star Wars prequels, okay? Let's not forget that. He was in the fucking prequel. Have I got the weapon yet? Yes. Damn fucking right. Son, I brought you into this world. Oh my god! Are you okay? Well, what do you think? You can come down here and shoot anytime you want. I just shot a BB bullet right through your body. Uh couldn't have done it without Jonas's help. You make sure to thank him. I think he's dying. And the thing's gone. With the blood is still there. Oh, That's one thing I don't like about this, the, the shooting is kind of awkward. Hi there. Oops. You mean I missed? Oops. Good work. It's one less ramp roads to deal with. Let's get a picture together. Capture the moment. Hey, Jonas, you sure you don't want that wood check? Come on, take the picture. How do I uh, put my weapon away? Whoa! <laughs> oh my god. Jonas is blind in one eye, my dad, you know, he's got a BB bullet, like, lodged in his, um, as far as I can tell, his kidney, he was, it was like up near his heart, yeah. My goat? If you say so. Why didn't he take a goat? So this year, you take the goat. Come on, that's not so bad. Everyone has to take it. You'll do just fine. But I'm sick, really. Anything I need to know about the goat? Yeah. Generalized occupational aptitude test. Goat. Everyone here in 
the vault at exit 116. Helps to figure out what sort of a job you'll have here in the vault. Oh. So, pay attention and try not to fall asleep. You know what the overseer says? We are born in the vault, we die in the vault. Each is tested to determine their abilities, that they may work for the betterment of all vault residents. Sound familiar? Do you have to die in the vault? That's not the way it works. And it won't do to go around asking questions of the man, especially not around the overseer. I want to tell you something now. It's important, so listen closely. This place, this vault, is not perfect, no. But it is your home. A safe home. Stay on the overseer's good side, and you always will be. You understand? I don't want to be his good side. He's creepy. What's up there? He smells of lead. That's not the life I want for you. And it's not what your mother wants for you either. <sighs> Bye. Yes, I get out of here. Good luck. Thanks for that. What else? Like, why is half my body cut off? Yeah. Medical clipboard, hopefully anything there I can. You know. What is that? I found a Vault Tech Limited Edition Bobblehead. Smart man knows a bandage on his wound. Oh, sweet! So you see the old man before class, eh? Yeah, fuck off. What's up with you? Oh, Jonas. I'm a little worried. <laughs> I hope Jonas can take a look at me soon. He's bald, he's coughing, he's got cancer. Poor guy. Nothing in there. That's empty as well. Oh. God, Butch, why don't you just leave me alone? That's what you do. I would hate that. Hi, Butch. Hey, look, it's smart enough. Afraid I ain't got time for your fancy words right now. So be it. Tell us next, you got some kind of gang, is that it? Only the baddest gang in Vault 101. Yeah. You don't know. We rule this vault, and what we say goes. You'll stay out of our way if you know what's good for you. What's going on here? None of your business, kid. Get out of here before you get hurt. If you mess with the tunnel snakes, you're asking for it. Got me? If you keep messing with the overseer. Maybe you're right. We can deal with her later. Come on, Tunnel Snakes. This little bitch isn't worth our time. Whatever you say, Butch. That's not very nice. Tunnel Snakes rule. Fine, let's go. You okay, bitch? Thanks for getting rid of them. Now show me your asshole. I don't know why they won't leave me alone. Just because my father is the overseer, I guess? Idiots. Your dad smells of blood. Hey. Hello. Yeah, just keep. Ah! Uh. All set for the goat? Trust me, it really isn't that bad. Just something everybody has to go through. That's nice. Sure, buddy. Come on. I'm sure you will, especially since it's multiple choice with no wrong answer. Isn't that a bit retarded? We'll start as soon as everyone's found to see. Good luck. Okay, so. Uh, that's all taken. Back off! Well, everyone's managed to find the classroom. Get stuck. No talking. And keep your eyes to yourselves. I want to look at that woman's ass again. Where is she? Yes, I'm talking to you, Mr. Deloria. Sure thing, Mr. Blotch. Unless anyone else has an insightful comment, let's get started. Oh, I need a drink. Question one. A forensic vault scientist runs up to you and yells, I'm going to put my quantum harmonizer in your photonic resonation chamber. Yeah, good day. response. But doctor, wouldn't that cause a parabolic destabilization of the fission singularity? Yeah, up your story, buddy. Say nothing but grab a nearby paper help about the science hand to talk about for all you're doing. You're smiling and blowing up the vault. 
say nothing but slip away before the scientists can continue his run. Up yours too, buddy. Question two. While working as an intern in the clinic, a patient with a strange infection in his foot stumbles through the door. The infection is spreading at an alarming rate, but the doctor stepped out for a while. What do you do? Obviously, the foot for the infection spreads, scream for help, medicate the infected area with the best of your ability, train the patient merely observe as the infection spreads. Yes, I'm an evil bastard. You discover a young boy lost in the lower levels of the brain tumor. He's hungry and frightened, but also appears to be in possession of stolen property. What do you do? Give the boy a hug, tell him everything will be okay, confiscate the stolen property by force, and leave the boy there as a punishment, pick the boy's pocket, and Protect the boy's boat, take the stolen property for yourself and leave him to his fate. Leave the boy safety and turn around. Uh, 